I am Richard Hosey of Hosey Honey. I am a beekeeper. Here in, in Midway, where this apiary is at, you're in the center of the bluegrass. I keep bees, and the bees make honey. We are going to use about 1,700 pounds of honey. I'm Ken Lee. I'm Master Brewer for Altex Lexington Brewing and Distilling Company. The uh, Kentucky Honey Barrel Brown Ale is part of our uh, seasonal series. We started it last year with a pumpkin ale, and then we continued into the spring uh, with a barley wine and into the uh, summer with a peach wheat beer. But this is our first ever winter uh, barrel aged series beer, the Kentucky Honey Barrel Brown Ale. We're using uh, locally sourced honey and ginger and locally sourced hops. Altex is an agricultural company in Kentucky, and we want to, as often as possible, source things from Kentucky farmers. I love the color of it, yeah. and uh, it's got the honeycomb on it up there. It is uh, full-bodied and full-flavored. It's really, really malty, typically somewhat sweet, and uh, that's why the uh, chance to use local honey and, and use that for that sweetness is going to be a real plus for us. It makes it easy. Uh, as a beekeeper to know that your honey has a market that it's going to go to. So my name is Tammy Horn and I'm the Kentucky State Apiarist. I work for the Kentucky Department of Agriculture. <laughs> honey has 14 antioxidants that never goes bad. Um, and, and it's the first fermentation agent that we have record of, even before wine. It's an exciting new product to have among Kentucky Proud products. This is really a big, big focus on local sourcing of uh, raw materials as much as we can. It's helped us considerably to be able to supply Alltech Lexington's Brewing and Distilling Company with uh, buckets of honey. Uh, I do it for the love of bees and not for the love of money, but basically for the love of honey. <laughs> Thank you.